Mainstream media likes to present Google Plus as a ghetto, as just this empty wasteland where nothing is happening. Well, I just logged in on a Sunday morning, and uh, that's probably the deadest time for Google Plus. And you can see here two beautiful photographs from Catherine Laplace Bouille. Here's a, photo, a post I just shared about NASA making a 246 foot blimp to create a star shade and commentary on that. Here is Fred Hicks talking about novels and games that are being made by his company. Some discussions between me and some friends. A photo from Trey Ratcliffe of, of a Ginza in Japan, a photograph he took. Here's a photograph from Kenya. Folks talking about games they've played. Here's Chris Brogan talking about making guitar picks out of hotel keys and other plastic cards using a pick punch. And other comments from folks talking about how they've used it and other things that they've used. For, uh, for making guitar picks. Here's a post about uh, NASCAR parts being reused for satellites. Here is uh, posting and talk about Mass Effect 3 and uh, just more and more and more stuff. This is all stuff that's come in in the past half hour on Google Plus in my circles. These are all people that I have followed, that I have control over in terms of who's posting it and who's doing it and all that kind of stuff. That's Google Plus for me. On a quiet Sunday morning, I'm getting tremendous value out of this thing. It's quite the ghetto.